At some point, every one of us has hit a wall when it comes to our ability to play our classes correctly. Sometimes it feels like the only way you could really improve is for someone to be looking over your shoulder as you play, pointing out what you're doing wrong. Or even just being able to spend 10 minutes watching a top 10 raider play and see how they play your class. Those two options are pretty big long shots. However, there is something just as good, Warcraft Locks. This tool is way more powerful than a lot of people realize, and today I want to go over some of the coolest features on the site so hopefully you can start to improve your play. The first thing to cover is how to actually lock. By heading over to the Warcraft Log site, you need to first make an account, then click the Get Started button. Once there, download and install the log client and fire it up before you start a raid. Live logs can be tracked and assessed whilst you are raiding, so data is always at your fingertips. So now you have your data, what do you actually do with it? Most people have used the site before to look at healing or DPS rankings, but it can do so much more than that. The first thing I'd recommend looking at is the problems panel. This can point out glaringly obvious issues such as potion usage, deaths and tanking issues. It's also capable of showing who's taking too much unnecessary damage. Next up, let's look at the analyze tab. At default, this shows just damage and healing. However, if you click on a player and then click either timeline or events, you get a detailed log of exactly how they executed their rotation. This is really useful if you're struggling to know what you should be casting at specific points. Remember, a lot of players use this tool, so if you're having issues, why not look up at the top ranking members of your class and see what they are doing differently to you in terms of rotation. Just remember, however, that you should not just look at the rank 1 log and copy that person. Look at their raid team and see what's different to yours. Getting your rank 1 log can sometimes be down to luck, or just that their raid setup was exactly perfect for them that fight. Make sure you look at multiple logs and draw conclusions from multiple data points. Finally, let's look at my personal favourite part of Warcraft Logs, the replay button. This tool allows you to watch fights back and see the positioning and numbers of every raid member. This is great when you're trying to spot positional errors. Were you where you should have been stood? Was the boss tanked in the right place? Were you in range of healers? Warcraft Logs is an extremely versatile tool that isn't taken advantage of by enough players. Being able to self-criticise your play is essential if you want to play at a high level. So why not make an account and see what you can learn about yourself as a player? So what's your favourite feature from Warcraft Logs? Let me know in the comments below. If you've enjoyed this video, please consider liking and subscribing. I've been Sinestra, and I'll catch you next time.